this is going to be the repower tractor. Now, it's a 1964, I believe, 4020. Uh, it was a gas. Um, there's no saving that motor. Narrow front, which the tires are good. And it's only got one remote, but it's also a power shift. So here is going to be the repower tractor. I mean, look at the, the sheet metal on this thing is really good. Uh, I can get new badges. Uh, the fenders are a little rusty, but I can get new uh, fenders for it too. But yeah, this thing, it, it's, it's nice. It's in really good shape. The grill and everything is really straight. All the sheet metal is really straight on it. But yeah, this is going to be a really good tractor. Put that 404 P-Pump in. Greetings and welcome back to the channel. Okay, I'm finally at it. I'm going to do the repower now. But first thing I got to figure out after doing all kinds of reading and getting all kinds of conflicted things on forums and stuff about what to do about this. Okay, so with the 7700 turbo engine that I've got over there, uh, Swisher turbo late model 7700 combine engine. Okay, so <clears throat> supposedly I can somehow use that flywheel off the 7700 but I have to have it machined I guess um, now this thing here uh, it's the cold start clutch um, for it's off this is off the gas engine so this flywheel is not going to work I measured the uh, major di um, tooth diameter and it's it's, it's not going to work it's the uh, I don't know if a diesel, an older diesel 404, if that flywheel will work, I, if I just have to get an older uh, 4020 flywheel, uh, that's not a gasser like this block here. But yeah, this isn't going to work. And so the only other thing I can think of is to tear this apart and to see if the other flywheel that of the 404 combine engine or yeah the 7700 combine engine and see if that flywheel can be machined to what i need to make work because i tell you this is this is going to be a doozy of a project so <clears throat> other than supposedly you gotta use a 4430 oil pan um you gotta do something with a water pump or move everything on the front of the tractor like a radiator um, the grill hoods got all come forward all that stuff if i have to move that forward an inch to make that work i think that's going to be what i'm going to do uh, the turbo is obviously not going to fit under the hood i don't know what i'm going to do about that yet because uh, I, hate, I hate to cut into this hood it's a nice hood but even the m and w turbo kits came with a hood patch so I and mean, that's just the way she goes. But now, <clears throat> before I trail off and lose you here, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pop these flywheels off, um, and I'm going to compare compare them, and uh, then we'll go from there. See if I can do some machining, um, or if I can get a 404 diesel original 4020 flywheel, or see what I have to do. Um, if you know exactly what I need to do, please do leave factual information in the comment box. Uh, so for right now, I'm going to first tear this thing apart. Uh, these are torqued between uh, 35 and 40 pounds. So I'm just going to crack her open here. And I don't have the tool to put it back together, but that's all right because we can still take it apart. No big deal. Um, So that's what the plan is, is hopefully, is uh, if I can get this figured out, then we can put, then we can put this on the motor, 
and I know there's a couple notches that need to be made, which are really no big deal. We can do that with an angle grinder. I mean, no big deal. Um, I think where where was it? Somewhere, somewhere along here needs to be notched out on one of these sides here somewhere. But like I said, it's no big deal. We can do that. Now this, yeah, see, I, I'm pretty sure someone's been in here before because these tabs are mangled pretty good. Like th these tabs have been bent at the factory and then unbent and then bent again. And according to the tax, this had relatively low hours on it. Now this is a 4020 gas power shift, but the engine was completely destroyed. We got a good deal on the tractor. We got a good deal on the engine. We just got to make the two things work. So, I'm just going to kind of back, back this stuff off here. I can't remember if this is supposed to be under spring tension, this part of it. I can't find too much on this. So, if I screw it up, then, I mean, this wouldn't have worked anyway then, right? I mean... I don't know. I don't think I'll screw anything up too bad that we can't save. Oh yeah, there's tension. I gotta do this. Uh, let's see. Hopefully, it just don't come flying, flying apart. I don't know if I should be standing in front of this. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, no explosions. Like I said, this is... I, I'm winging this. I don't know what I'm doing, um, but I do plan on trying to make a pretty detailed video on me doing this whole project, start to finish. So it's probably going to be several series. Uh, you'll have, or you know, it's a several part series. You, you just have to, you know, subscribe and help a guy out, and and uh, while I post these videos. Um, some of this might take, I'm hoping to do a, a weekly upload. Some of this might take some time, but I'm hoping to do at least weekly uploads on this until it's done. Or at least make it to where it makes sense, but you know, I, I don't know. Okay, so that's that. There's my. Okay, so this is good. Okay, so that goes like that. And this is, there is no way that this will ever compare with that over there. Okay, so we're definitely looking at two different things here because this with that over there. Well, I don't see any feasible way to make that work. Okay, so we're. And uh, I don't even think that can be machined. There's doll rotten dolls in here for. Yeah, I, I didn't even think about that. So what I'm thinking, so what would work for that? Would, would, it ha would I have to use a diesel? Because a gas is completely different. Okay, that theory is confirmed. So what I'm going to have to do is here in a couple seconds, I'm going to go like figure out if I need a 404 diesel 4020 flywheel and see if that will work. 
Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I think for what it's worth, I got it figured out. I, or at least I have somewhat of a plan. Okay, so I just mentioned a little bit in my video there in the captions where I said something about the diesel has less teeth than the gas and <clears throat> the IDs of the ring gear are a different size. But what I found is somebody in some forum, I can't think of what his name was now, was saying that he has done this because this here with the... Uh, this block, what was it, with uh, this serial number here. Apparently, these are the hardest repower to do with the 4020. Um, <clears throat> so, it's going to be a challenge either way I look at it. So, okay, so the guy said he made the gas flywheel work with that motor. So, all we got to do is take this to a machine shop with that, and they can machine take this ring gear off, machine this down, this OD down to fit that ring gear, and then I also have to have the bolt holes line up. They match up, but they don't match up with the top dead center mark. So the TDC mark has to be rescribed, and then the dowel pin over there um, will have to be, well, this flywheel will have to be drilled out so it'll have to make this ID bigger and then drill a hole in here somewhere for that dowel pin so okay all bullshit aside um, all I got to do then is take it to a shop and do all that stuff and it should be good to go um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to see it's Saturday now. I'm going to call machine shop Monday. Um, I got to replace that rear main seal on that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload this video and be a big disappointment. And then when I get this stuff back, hopefully here in a week or two, next video I'm going to put all this stuff back onto that. And then we're going to try fitting it mocking it up with with the tractor there and see if everything goes good with that um, now the oil pan thing I I don't know why the oil pan won't work like they say you have to have a 4430 oil pan if somebody can throw a comment down there explaining that to me that would be awesome because I can't figure it out but other than that um, thanks for watching and uh, <clears throat> yeah See you uh, next video.